do not get, make a lot of transactions on people they've never met. All right? A very small number of their transactions are people that they've never met, that they're buying a lead or they're, they're doing search engine marketing or whatever they're doing. 74% is in our staff. A lot of my clients say it, it's higher than that. Their business comes from people that they've already known or other people telling them about it. So our number one objective to stay relevant is to very much so continue to market to people you already know. You've got to turn everyone you know into a megaphone. So then it doesn't matter about lead capture and all that stuff because your, your clients are becoming your megaphones. And if you can do a good job in today's world, as I hear Greg talk and I hear all this, this stuff about the consumer, the consumer, and, and I, I think Greg puts it great, when you talk about you know narrowing down, consumers don't buy homes on the internet. They eliminate properties. Okay, it's called property elimination. So what they need to be is empowered to be able to have the information that's important to them. And it's a you benefit to the client. So therefore, if the client has empowered and you're empowering them and they would refer to you or there's someone that you already know or you, the next level is your every marketing, all your uh, direct mail and your door knocking and all that stuff, you're creating those relationships. Those are still close enough to people that know you that they're going to trust you and they're going to be happy to give you their information because in return, they're getting something. So they trust that, that relationship. Belly to belly. I mean, that's, that's the first place we start. And that's what all of my clients just about get most of their transactions. I'm sure there's some in this room who will argue and say, look, I get more deals off the internet off people I've never met before. Great. More power to you. I'd love to hear how you do that. But what I'm seeing right now is about 6% of the transactions are coming from people you've never met. So therefore, if 94% are coming from either people you already know or marketing that you're doing in your neighborhood, then I'm going to focus on that low-hanging fruit first and not worry about some people coming to my site not registering.